Hi everybody, this is Katie. Welcome back to my channel. I am super passionate about helping you attract and keep high quality men by tapping into your unique feminine power. So in this video, I'll be talking about what masculine, high quality and driven men are looking for in a woman. But before I get into those tips, I just want to quickly tell you about a free webinar I am hosting on Wednesday that will be going into the three secrets of high value irresistible women that inspire quality men to commit. So if you would like to know how to be that high quality irresistible woman that inspires quality men to commit, I highly recommend you go register for that webinar down below in the descriptions right now. Um, and you know, that's going to be an information packed webinar. So let's get into the rest of this video. So number one, what are men looking for is a woman who shows up energetically feminine. Okay, so a lot of women assume being feminine is about mostly looking feminine. Okay, so they attribute you know, having a certain hair that looks nice and doing makeup and wearing dresses and wearing colors and jewelry and that is being feminine and because looking feminine. What I'm going to say is that the looking feminine can help you feel feminine if it makes you feel feminine. So what I mean by that is if you look in the mirror and you feel pretty, you feel beautiful, well, it doesn't matter what you're wearing, then you are tapping into your feminine energy. You are bringing across that feminine vibe. However, that's not true for everybody. Okay, Some women will put on something that intellectually they know looks good. You know, they put on a lot of bling and the sexy dress and the makeup, but inside they feel awkward and uncomfortable, unnatural. Then that's not, I mean, obviously that means she isn't going to show up energetically feminine. So there are two different things, okay? So um, the most important thing is how you feel. And highly masculine men are really drawn to and attracted to feminine energy women. And once again, on, a, on an energy level here, not on the physical, right? So when you tap into your feminine energy and you feel in your body that you feel feminine, whatever that means for you, because each person is a little bit different, you are actually calling upon and teasing out and uh, allowing a man to show up energetically masculine, which is great because that's how men feel that attraction towards you because the feminine and masculine energy is like polar opposites. So when they're together, they create that insane, intense spark, that spark of attraction, you know? Um, so that, that's what that comes from. And it's just about a feeling level, okay? It's not intellectually. So that's, that's what I mean by showing up energetically feminine. Number two, a man will look for a woman who, whose values and life goals are aligned with his. So my definition of a high quality man is a man who is commitment ready. So this is a man who is future focused. He already knows who he is. He knows what he wants, even though he may know he may not know exactly the, 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 the woman yet that he wants. He knows he wants someone. He knows he wants to build a life with somebody that he has a strong connection with. So a man like this, you'll see signs of a man like this because on the first date, he will talk about future stuff. He will be asking serious questions like, what are you looking for? Okay, are, are you planning to stay in this town? You know, he'll, he'll be analyzing, right? Are you gonna be relocating soon? Like, is this going to work out? What's your religious background? You know, um, you know maybe he, he, he might even talk about money a little bit, who knows, depending on his personality and what he's really thinking about, what he's planning for the future. Either way, he will be asking questions that clearly shows he is thinking ahead. He is planning the future versus a man who looks like he he is just present focused he is just in the now he's just enjoying life he's not even he's not thinking about next week he tells you he's not thinking about next week he's just like very you know everything is just i just want to have fun now it's all in the in the now 
that kind of guy most likely is still on his path to trying to discover what he wants. He may be in a little bit of a, um, a hard situation. You, you don't know, but most likely if a guy isn't, doesn't have direction in, in that way in his relationships, that means he is not relationship ready. He is still trying to work it out on his own. And, um, you know, I, I wouldn't really spend too much time on that kind of guy because that guy will waste a lot of your time if you know what you want. So number three, a man is looking for a woman who is driven. That doesn't necessarily mean driven in terms of her career, okay? It can mean that, but not necessarily. She just needs to be driven in something. So that could be she's driven to live a healthy lifestyle and she really cares about that and cares about the people around her also living a healthy lifestyle and taking care of themselves. Or she is driven to just help um, you know, save the animals, for example, or just help her community grow. Uh, or she's driven to study or to teach or something, right? She needs to have some kind of passion in her life, some kind of direction that is outside, you know, just, just her relationships. Number four, a man is looking for a woman who has high standards. So we are all, sometimes we all can slack. We can all get lazy or fall behind a little bit. So a man really respects when a woman can call him out on his crap, can tell him, remind him of when, of his goals and of his values and when he's starting to slip. Okay, so she's kind of like gives him that little push, little push up the bum um, to remind him. And he really respects a woman like that because we all have moments, right, where we just slack or where we get down on ourselves. And she has that standard for him, but she also has that standard for herself. Number five, he wants a woman who lets him experience himself as a man. Okay, a man wants to feel like he has freedom to be who he is, to evolve and, you know, to be that next level version of himself because we are all wanting to evolve one way or, the, or another, we're going to evolve. So he wants to feel like he has freedom to do that. When we, you know, try to control our man, when we try to get him to do what we want him to do, when we have certain expectations or we are judging him, that's when he's going to feel boxed in, right? He's going to feel that pressure coming down on him and he, he's going to have a hard time then being who he is. And, and it usually starts really, really slowly. It snowballs slowly in a relationship. But that is something men will be hypersensitive to, especially in the beginning, okay? When he, he's first dating you, he's going to be looking out for that. Number six, he is looking for a woman with, a, with an open heart. So he's looking to see, do you have room for him in your heart? Are you willing to take emotional risks with him? Okay, so he's not the only one standing out there naked, you know, like risking it all whilst you are trying to stay protected and hidden and, or, you know, um, and or barricaded up. <laughs> so he, he wants to know that you are, you are going to play with him, okay, in that game, in the vulnerability game. And number seven he wants a woman who is not afraid to stand up for who she is and you know what she believes in because he wants a woman who can be authentically her that means he can really trust her you know we we all kind of can relax around people who are authentic even if sometimes they say things we don't like sometimes they may hurt our feelings and there could be a little bit of a conflict at least if we can see they are being congruent to their values, we still can relax because we know, okay, this guy isn't going to be like a chameleon and suddenly change on me. You know, there's a certain level of stability there and security there. And that is nice. Okay. We all want to be around people where we can kind of just relax into our authenticness, where we can say, okay, we're just all human, right? We all have flaws. It's okay. You know, it's all right to have flaws. And um, there's something really nice about that. So we can all have a level of love and compassion for each other. 
So those are the seven tips on what, or some seven things that of uh, what a man is looking for in a woman. Just to quickly recap, he's looking for a woman who shows up energetically feminine because then he's gonna feel hyper, hyper attracted to her. Number two, he is looking for a woman whose values and life goals aligns with his because he wants to know if he is future focused that he she is going to fit well into his lifestyle. Number three, he's looking for a woman who is driven. She has passions of her own, uh, goals of her own. Number four, she has standards for him and for herself. Number five, she allows him to experience himself as a man and to go deeper with himself. Number seven, she, she is, uh, he's looking for a woman with an open heart. And number seven, he's looking for a woman who is not afraid to stand up for who she is. So those are the tips. And um, that's pretty much it. So um, I just want to remind you guys that once again, this Wednesday, I'll be doing a live webinar training on three secrets of high value, irresistible women that inspire quality men to commit. So if you'd like to know how to be the woman to attract and keep quality men and make them commit to you, go all in on you, then you want to check out this webinar. Do not miss out. And that's pretty much it. I'll talk to you real soon. If you like this video, please like me. You can uh, comment below, leave me some questions. I love answering your questions. And um, you know, subscribe to my channel and I'll be back with more next week. Bye.